Today in Ellen Dean's kitchen I'm going to make banana muffins especially for the orangutan caring week. There's the orangutans and I've also got an audience today of orangutans here in the corner um, so I'd better make sure I do them properly. I've got my wooden spoon, huge banana you can tell I didn't buy that at the supermarket because it's slightly on the bent side. Um, and all my ingredients are here, including on my iPad, my recipe. So, I'm going to wear all the ingredients and we're going to start and make the banana muffins. Here we go. And here we are mashing the banana. Let's go. I think we should have two bananas, but this one's so big, I thought we'd better only use one today. First we have 12 ounces or 340 grams of self-raising flour. Now I'm going to add um, a tablespoon of baking powder. Oops. Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> I think that'll do. I'm going to add um, half a teaspoonful of salt. Notice I'm not doing it over the bowl this time at the risk of putting too much in. So we'll do it here and we have half a teaspoonful of ginger. What a bunny colour I've got in my bowl now. And now we're going to grate some cinnamon. At least I think. Right now we have two free range eggs. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to beat these uh, eggs with a fork. I was going to use my wooden spoon but Laura said I hadn't got to, I had to do it with a fork. So here we go. And you'll have noticed that we don't need the whisk, the electric whisk, um, which I've missed today actually because I like to use the whisk. But we don't need it. And in the background here we have some milk to go in as well. How many ounces of milk have we got going? Can you just check it out on the recipe, please? <laughs> right, okay, my trusty iPad. Um, has the recipe. It's two, eight fluid ounces of milk. So that will go in next. Shall I put it in now? There we go. Make sure we get it all out. You might notice I've spilled a little bit of flour on here but I am learning. It didn't until Google Earth came along. I didn't even know when we, that we had a kitchen and I spotted it on Google Earth. And now I'm getting on my, uh, finding my way about their kitchen. And I'm getting instructions here from behind the camera that I've got to whisk faster. There we go. Now we're adding uh, 6 ounces of demerara sugar of 170 grams. I like ounces, I don't know about you. So we'll add that. Um, and I've melted how many ounces of butter? Have I melted? Four ounces. Four ounces of melted butter and what was that? <laughs> I, don't <know. laughs> I don't know what it is in grams, you'll have to I, work that out for yourself. you clever people out there can tell well, us. it's melted. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Bit of a mess. Um, okay, now what do we do? One uh, teaspoon vanilla. Oh, one teaspoonful of vanilla. Don't Here do it know. over the dish. Yeah, I'll do it over the bowl. Okay, that's a teaspoonful of vanilla. I don't know if it's going to wash up after this. We'll have to get the housekeeper in. <laughs> <laughs> Only. Um, right, now what do I do? Um, you can tell I've never done this before. Check please. check the destructions. Yeah. Um, gradually fold the wet ingredients into the dry with a large oh, spoon. Hang on. When do you put the banana in? Um, oh. And two rough ah now the banana <laughs> ah, now. I nearly forgot the important thing. Oh, the orangutans told me. Mm. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> it plops in just like that. Right. Okay. Right. What do we do next? Mix uh, that together. Mix that together. Where's me? Um... Oh gosh. It does look a bit of a mess, <laughs> but I'm assured that this is normal. Um, it looks a bit of a funny colour too, especially with the brown sugar um, and the banana going in. Give it a good stir. 
And I'm going to add the banana and the eggs and milk a bit at a time until, oh, hang on, right? And now I've got to fold it in. You haven't got to mix it, you fold it. Talk and twerk, dear, talk and twerk. <laughs> twerk. How do you twerk? Right, here we go. Now don't overwork it, just okay. put a bit more in. Oops. It says on that recipe. I've bit never more. done this before. You could get your children to make this actually because it's so messy and they'll love it. They love to make messy stuff, don't they? Not just children. <laughs> yeah. I love it because I'm a cheeky monkey. Gloria's waving me from behind the camera and say, hurry. And this is what it looks like. The finished product. And here we have them. We have six. And we have enough mixture left to make another six. But we're going to put these in first, see what they come out like, see what they taste like, and put the other ones in. Can you manage three of these muffins, do you think? These lovely banana muffins for a orangutan caring week? Um, it just goes to show that what, you know whatever you do for this fundraising week um, will be very much appreciated by the Orangutan Protection Foundation and these orangutans and the rainforest help to protect them. So see what you can do for a fundraiser.